for one more quick question. With a, what mass of lead nitrate with a molar mass of 331.2 grams per mole is required to react with 1.25 liters of 0.55 moles per liter solution of potassium chloride. Okay, so they already gave us a balanced chemical equation. So this will help us answer the question. Okay, so our potassium chloride solution had a volume of 1.25 liters and a concentration of 0 0.55 moles per liter. And we also know that our lead nitrate has a molar mass equal to 331.2 grams per mole. And we're trying to find its mass. So step one is to first find the number of moles of potassium chloride. So we do that by multiplying our concentration and our volume. So the concentration was 0 0.55 moles per liter, and the volume was 1.25 liters. So this cancels out our liters and tells us that we have 0 0.688 moles of potassium chloride. So now step two is to use the mole ratios to find the number of moles of the lead nitrate. So if we know that the number of moles of the potassium chloride is 0 0.688 moles, then we can multiply this by the ratio in which it reacts with the lead nitrate. So I always put what I'm looking for on the top. So we have one mole of lead nitrate that reacts with two moles of KCl. So you notice that the KCl moles will cancel out and we get 0 0.344 moles of the lead nitrate. So now step three is to find the mass. So if we recall that mass is equal to the number of moles times molar mass, we can just plug in our values, so 0 0.344 moles of the lead nitrate times its molar mass, which is 331.2 grams per mole. So our grams is 113.85 grams is needed. Okay, so let's see what our junior tutor, junior tutor said. They wrote out everything that was given, found the number of moles of potassium chloride. Yep. And then they did the mole ratios to obtain the equivalent moles of lead nitrate and got 0 0.3438. And lastly, they solved for mass by multiplying the number of moles times the molar mass. Okay, so this solution is...